morning, welcome to day two in Lyon. Uh, we're just gonna head to the zoo today, which is in a free park, sort of up towards the north of the city, and uh, have to get some food. Actually, speaking of food, there's a baguette shop over there. Let's go get a baguette. Just halfway through demolishing this baguette and this praline tart that we bought, it cost only six euros. It's an absolute bargain, you've got to check this place out. It's kind of where you wouldn't expect. Let me tell you what I mean by that. Petrol station. We're off to the zoo. This is the botanical gardens in the main park here in Lyon. There's a zoo as well, it's all free. Uh, it's a beautiful day to be looking around as well, it's like 30 degrees. Easy metro ride, perfect day for it. This is like one part of the botanical gardens here. It's absolutely beautiful. Right, where in, in any city, where do you get that for free? Well done, Leon. So I thought that was just one giraffe, but there's actually two. So that was a zoo in Lyon. I really hope you enjoyed that. Can't believe how good that was for a free attraction. Definitely worth doing while you're in Lyon. beautiful place like you can do mini golf here you can do boating there's a little restaurant as well it's quite expensive but um, it is worth it if you if you need a drink or anything like that they do like light snacks and waffles um, but yeah for a free attraction in Leon this is incredible I'll happily come again Park door here in Leon. Really, really good day out. Really enjoyed myself. Um, the zoo 
was a real highlight. The botanical gardens actually were quite surprising. Didn't expect them to be that good. But now we're going to head back to the apartment. I'm going to chill out, do some editing, and uh, got a little surprise for you later on. One of the best bouchons in the city. I'll see you there. Right, dressed to impress. Back here. Oh. So we're on the way to Daniel and Denise right now. We're going to leave in about five minutes. Um, but I'm going to see you back here at the apartment for a full review on the uh, on the restaurant or the bouchon as it is. Um, so I'll see you later. Alright guys, just got back from the restaurant. It's the, um, uh, the bouchon. I'll just think of the name in a minute. I've just got back from the restaurant, Daniel Le Denise. What an absolute nightmare getting back. Uh, they closed the metro, um, so the line uh, B, I believe it was, we were supposed to get back on, that wasn't open. Um, but the food itself was absolutely awesome. I loved it. Um, we had wine pairings as well, which we never expected for 51 euros. Incredible, like the best value restaurant I think I've ever been to. Um, certainly in France, if not anywhere else. First course we had the famous pate and the pate en croute. It won a championship for its chef uh, back in 2009, I believe. Light pastry, lovely filling, very rich, but a nice sized portion for a tasty menu. We then have the pie quenelle, uh, very famous of course in this part of the world. Lovely soft mousse, uh, really nice shellfish based sauce. Kind of like the lasagna of crab if you've ever been to the square in London. It's a bit like that. Amazing flavor, really good. We then had a fish dish which was like um, some sort of fish, I couldn't remember what exactly it was but we had it with like butter and parsley and capers, really nicely done. We then had the best dish I've probably ever eaten anywhere ever, breast chicken, morels, cream sauce and these like wafer thin potatoes like that, they were really really good. So Moorish, we had sweet carrots as well, we had some macaroni, it was just an onslaught of cholesterol but so worth it, <laughs> honestly it was so good. For dessert they surprised us they had like um, a two-tiered thing with all these different little desserts on it uh, lemon tart eclair but there was like a shoe bun which was like a tart praline um, like we had from the baguette shop earlier also there was a madeleine as well beautifully soft inside every single dessert was magic loved it it was kind of a split between tourists and locals but that was kind of to be expected with the restaurant's popularity and also they kind of put the French people like the locals in the front room and everyone else in the back room so sometimes the service was a little bit slow a little bit erratic took forever to get the bill and obviously with the transport delays on the way back it made us a bit late coming back but overall amazing restaurant you have to go check them out Daniel Edenese I'll put the link in the description box below and I'm gonna sign off for tonight uh, we're heading to Grenoble tomorrow um, for a day out just to check it out see what it's about as always if you enjoyed the video give it a thumbs up there's plenty more in this series to come so i really appreciate if you subscribe to my channel um, and also you can follow me on social media all the links in the description box below twitter pinterest instagram facebook and i'll see you on the next video